Hello friends, in this video we will study about the RSA algorithm. The full form of RSA is Rivest, Samir and Aldemar. Uh, these are the three scientists. And this algorithm is used for encryption and decryption of messages. Encryption and decryption. Okay. So before we go to algorithm, we will define some notations here that will be used in the algorithm. Notations. First, we define capital P for plain text. We define capital C for ciphertext here P and Q are prime numbers and phi of n is Euler Tosian function Euler's Tosian function there are four uh, Euler Tosian functions that is phi of 1 equal to 0 phi of some this is some prime number p equal to p minus 1 phi of m into n equal to phi of m into phi of n where m and n are co-prime to each other and phi of p to the power e where p is prime number equal to p to the power e minus p to the power e minus 1 now after seeing these notations we are now going to the algorithm so here is the algorithm the very first step is we define two very large prime numbers that is P and Q prime numbers and then we calculate n equal to P into Q and third step is when we calculate phi n that is either associate function equal to P minus 1 into Q minus one and then fourth step is we calculate a variable e which is less than phi n and greater than one which is co prime to phi of n which is co prime to phi of n then we calculate a variable d in such a way that d into e equal to 1 mod phi of n okay here here e and, and n are public keys and d is private key and the the public key is used for the encryption this is used for encryption and the private key is used for decryption so now the next step is we calculate the cipher text equal to the plain text 
टू द पावर ई मॉड एन एंड दिस साइफर टेक्स इज गोइंग टू द रिसीवर एंड देन रिसीवर कैलकुलेट द प्लेन टेक्स्ट बाई सी टू द पावर डी मॉड ऑफ एन this is all the rsa algorithm we will take one example and see the working of this algorithm let's take an example uh, let's take the value of t equal to 70 and q equal to 31 we can see that both these values are prime numbers so we calculate in equal to p into q that is 17 into 31 that will be equal to 480 sorry that will be equal to 527 now we calculate phi of n that is equal to pi p minus 1 into q minus 1 that is equal to 16 into 30 that will be equal to 480 and now we have to take a uh, find the value of e um, actually we take some value of e you can take any value that is co prime to the 480 that is final we take any value of e that is uh, co prime that is co uh, co uh, co prime to pi of n so we take uh, e equal to 7 7 is clearly uh, co prime to 480 now we have to calculate the value of d so d into e equal to 1 mod phi of n or d equal to e inverse mod phi of n and we calculate the value of d by using the extended euclidean algorithm so we have found that the value of d equal to 343 by using extended euclidean algorithm so uh, here is uh, uh, phi n this is the phi n and this is the e we divide 480 by 7 the this is the remainder this is the quotient and this is the remainder and we take uh, a random value of 0 1 we can take or we can also take the value of 1 and 0 and uh, we find t1 t equal to t1 minus q t2 this is the first step and then we shift the values left that is 7 here 4 here and again we divide 7 by 4 that is uh, then quotient will be 1 and remainder will be 3 then we shift this number here this number here and again we find the value of t by this formula this process goes again and again and finally the value of t1 when the value of rt is 0 then the value of t1 will be the value of d that is minus 317 mod 480 equal to 343 so we have found the value of d so public key will be you know that public key will be e and n that is 7 and 527 and private key will be d that is 343 now if we uh, if we are given with some plain text p then we then we will find the value of cipher text is equal to p to the power e mod 
m that is p to the power 7 mod 5 to 7 and again we can calculate the plain text by using this formula that is cyber text that is this c to the power d mod n that is equal to c to the power value of d 343 mod 5 to 7 that is where the full answer thank you